how because see like the thing is when you moved when you moved away like we didn't we kind of lost contact completely and where you kind of come back where you kind of came back into my life specifically and kind of around the same time you were uh you and josh were planning to move in together um was like i was going through a pretty rough time too right and you and i that's where i got to know more about you and i was pretty surprised to be honest okay. like i was caught off guard by you having like a a more like a what's the right word like a post yeah but like you know like when you're lost like a navigator like a um when you're lost and you ask for directions like you stop and you and then the person points you like yeah it's you know down that way or whatever right okay. it was kind of like that was the feeling i got when i yeah when i talked to you okay um you were like hey how are you doing right like just checking in just cuz um at the time i was uploading stuff about how to deal with uh post post breakups and yeah. how to deal with uh at the time i was getting um tested for ADHD cuz i was like maybe there's something there with, to that cuz my sister got uh diagnosed with ADHD so i'm like you know i've never been very good at school so maybe i'll go and get that tested and so i was doing videos about that that was before this was all together so when i talked to you i guess you had seen a uh, couple of those videos and you were like hey yeah how are you doing <laughs> you know it's just like something like that i'm like yeah not that great you know <laughs> uh and we had like a long chat but i was surprised because i had never seen that side of you when we were talking like when we were growing up and we were kids right that side nobody really talks about stuff like that when you're kids right like you don't no, you don't have no, those no. uh uh, maybe you don't even have the maturity to figure out what's going on. Yeah, it's mostly stuff. just like jokes and stuff. And do, you, do you know what I learned uh, in my life? Something uh, about that. Uh, you know, the whole topic of maturity and like, yeah. you know, finding finding yourself, you know, somewhere in your life is a lot of it really does depend on the type of people that you uh, you talk to, you meet. Yeah, because. A lot of people that I've met throughout my life, I would definitely would not be the same person if I never met them. Mm. You know, no, no matter how small of an impact that they make, it matters. Yeah, I, well, I don't, I don't think I ever got a chance to, to like say thank you. Maybe I did, but I don't know if I formally was like, "Hey, this really helped," or mm -hmm. uh, gave you feedback. But uh, it was very, like. It was grounding is the right word for that okay. yeah. of like things were kind of a chaos. Like at the time, like things were all over the place. I had no idea what was next because I'm like, where am I going to move? Cause like <laughs> when you live with somebody that you're dating and then you're not wow. with them anymore, <laughs> yeah. uh, you have to figure a lot of stuff out. Yeah. Like, where am I going to go? What am I going to do next? Who like who am I live with? And, and, and at the time too, like um, I, wasn't i didn't want to be like at the place i was working at anymore like i got it got to a point where i was like this isn't healthy so everything kind of collapsed at once yeah. so so like when i talked to you i was trying to just find like my northern star right like yeah something to grab on something to grab onto and i was just so caught off guard in a good way of like yeah. you just kind of popped in and you were like hey what's up like <laughs> And, like, I was like, all right, you know, I don't know where this is going to go, but, you know, I'll just tell you what's going on and see what happens. Yeah. And what I appreciated about that conversation was that it wasn't, like, you weren't there to tell me what I could have done better. Like, you weren't there to tell me that, hey, like, do this or do that. You were just kind of like, yeah, that's rough. <laughs> like yeah. that and a lot of times that's kind of what people need is just to no, like I completely so, agree it's like someone just to to hear you out and be like i you know i don't need you to solve my world's problems which is something that i've had to work on is like when people come to me 
instinctively, like I want to try to figure, help them figure it out. Mm -hmm. But that wasn't your approach. Your approach was very like, yeah, yeah, that's really hard. You know, I've had something like that happen or this is what I, what I experienced and, you know, and we shared experiences, right? So that was really sobering to, to have the, like the, Hey, like I'm here. I don't know how I can help you, but I'm here. Right. And there was a lot of confidence in that in you of like, I don't have all your, I don't have like the answer for you, but uh, I'm listening. Right. (laughs) And everyone needs that. Everyone needs someone to listen to them. So for everybody watching, right. Like that's something that was, uh, you, you showed up at a pretty important time. 